He, he doesn't have a lot to say. He oh. Balls for legs. He does! It's gross. <laughs> he has little testicle legs. I mean, wait, can you get like a side view of him? Can you talk to him from the side? Uh, oh, no, maybe, let's see. No. He, oh, he is unfazed! <laughs> Gosh, that's so great. That's ter like attention to detail in 1999. Right, this is fantastic. Okay, so let me see what we got in the pack. One, okay, maybe get a couple more potions. Or no, we got super potions. We're pff, yeah, nine. We We're fine. Um, oh, what's the team right now? I'd recommend putting uh, Capperoni in the front. Oh, okay. Because he can peck away the competition. You don't want to do Gad to try to get. Well, he's higher level. Okay. Yeah, Capperoni needs to evolve. What, what was it? 20 something? 20? 20? But still. Nice and even. That's good. I like nice and even. Yeah. Yo, Challenger. Why are you even talking to this nard? <laughs> this nard? <laughs> Look at him. He's like, what types are weak to fire, flying, uh, shit. What, what, what do you Oh, is this have? about to be a double battle? No. Psych, yeah. that's fucking not this gen. <laughs> Actually, fun fact. Yeah. There is someone who's doing a hack of gold and silver where you can do double battles. That's interesting. It's really cool. And it actually looks really good. Look at her face. The one on the right? Yes. Oh my gosh, she it's, looks so upset. She's derping. <laughs> Amy and May. So they're still twins fighting. Oh man, that's a yeah. fat oh, ladybug. <laughs> that is a fat female ladybug. You got a couple of years on him. She, sorry. You yeah. got a couple of years on her. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh man, Peck is super strong. This is great. Mm -hmm. Didn't affect yeah. Capperoni. Yeah. Okay. That's just the way of saying it failed, by the way. You're say, that sounds like you're immune. <laughs> yeah, actually, fun fact. I think Supersonic's the least accurate move in the game when you don't count one-hit KO moves. Really? It's that bad. <laughs> Always seemed to fucking hit me when I was a kid, though. I sure. swear. That was, that was the worst. Confusion. I never understood why Supersonic was a move when Confusion does the exact same thing with perfect accuracy. I will never understand Supersonic. Does Confusion have perfect accuracy? No, no. Did I say Confusion or Confuse Ray? No, Confuse Ray. Confuse Ray has perfect accuracy. What the fuck? Supersonic does the same thing, but 55% accurate. Yeah, why would you have that? I it's don't dumb. understand why it's a move. I understand why it's a move now, because they made it so some moves go through Substitute. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Yeah. They go past the Substitute? Yeah, so if you use, like... Uh, there's like this one move, Bug Buzz, that's like a really strong bug move. Uh -huh. It goes right through substitutes. So it's like, I'm a psychic type, I'm gonna substitute to scout. And it's like, and you're, you're, <laughs> you're just killing yourself. That's actually hilarious. Yeah, hey, look, it's Big Al. <laughs> Big, Big Al. Big Al's Caterpie Farm. Come on down. Uh, Two, three, 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 three for four. <laughs> three for five. Buy one, get one free. We'll throw in a Butterfree. You want, you want some, you want some Caterpillars? <laughs> Buy one, get T butter Take five. Free. Yeah, alright, alright. <laughs> Ooh, that was good. That was pretty good. <laughs> Call right now, I'll double the offer, except it's Weedles, we're sorry. Don't <laughs> we, touch it. We got a weird, we got a weird crop. <laughs> Don't touch it. Don't touch it, you'll die. Literal poison. <laughs> we'll kill you free. in just an hour. <laughs> we'll throw in an antidote, free. <laughs> bring your kids. Don't let them touch the Weedles. <laughs> bring your kids. Don't bring your kids, they're dangerous. Don't bring your kids, but they will die kids. without fail. We're desperate. <laughs> <laughs> we need money. There are Weedles. No one likes them. No one likes Weedle. Like real talk, I, if a Weedle walked in my house, I'd probably be terrified. I'd be like, if he walked in, I'd be like, oh, it's, 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 it's fine. It's splurging. <laughs> it's splurging all over the place. No, Weedle like, no man. Weedle's kind of scary. He's just a gross bug. He's the gross bug Pokemon. <laughs> you know, it's the, bu the, the bug the you see on the floor, and you're like, oh fuck that, and you step on it. Yeah. That's what it's. That's what it says in the Pokedex. You can't step on it because it's so pointy. <laughs> right. It's like when, it's like those enemies from uh, Superstar Saga with like or like Paper oh, Mario the with the well yeah or like Goombas with the little spikes in their heads. Oh yeah, they're like a staple. Oh definitely. Why didn't they make a Paper Mario for Game Boy Color so we could uh, play it immediately? Oh my god, that'd be fantastic. That'd be kind of hard. It'd be a really bad game to be honest. Yeah, <laughs> it'd be interesting. It'd probably just be like a straight yeah. RPG like fucking Pokemon. Mm -hmm. I guess. Like I mean I don't know like how else they'd do that. Yeah. <laughs> Dear God. We're bringing that up? We don't talk about that. Alright, alright. But no, yeah, it'd probably just be... I feel like the, this... I, feel, I was thinking about this the other day. I was thinking about fucking Animorphs in this game. <laughs> and I feel like RPGs like this are probably the easiest game to make for this system. You know? Right. I guess maybe platformers, but even then, like, I feel like... No, because you have to deal with, like, the... Uh, what am I thinking of? Like, not even the gravity. What's the word I'm thinking of? Just like the jump arcs and stuff. Yeah, like uh, motion. Like what do you call it? The Control? motion. Because uh, like, just having a grid-based, like a tile-based game like this that just switches to the battle and then switches back. It's like it's pretty easy on the you know. Yeah, and on they, the honestly, they're they're more visual, appe visually appealing. Yeah, and then it can be like more story-based and stuff. I don't know. Cause I, I feel like it. maybe the NES was was really good at doing platformers. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're really popular then, obviously, oh, yeah. but that that was the game. Like now, it's like. 
Actually, I don't even know what it is now, honestly, but for a while it was like shooters. Big, big, oh, simulators. That, yeah, <laughs> you are right. You are very right. <laughs> Fucking taking a shit simulator. 2017. Oh, simple. It would be like simulators. That um, sprite's not bad. Well, no, Golden Silver's great sprites. Like, but yeah. Were there some bad. bad ones earlier? No, I, I don't know. I still got, like, residue from <laughs> fucking Animorphs. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, but, um, yeah, simulators. For sure. Oh, that, and, like, I guess Minecraft as a whole. <laughs> or just uh, creative mode games, like games with crafting. Oh, oh yeah, like, uh, what would you call those? Like, oh, I don't know if open adventures. I guess crafting, like crafting survival Craft them ups. Craft them ups? Craft them ups. I just like, I love when people just add them ups to, like, you know, shoot them ups, <laughs> -em stab them ups. <laughs> Welcome to Big Al's, uh. Do what you want, hypnosis? Pepperoni, yes. It's a sleep move. Okay. It's a good move. I, th I think there's probably something to get rid of, like, Lear or something. Growl? Are you kidding me? Yeah, let's get rid of Growl. <laughs> that's, that's bullshit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Sweet. Got a status move. Yeah. It's always useful. Well, I mean, Get also has. He has hypnosis, hypnosis too, yeah. Oh, well, got a sleep team here. Can yeah. I just, I'm just gonna fight. You might as well just fight all over the experience. Yeah, that's what I always do with gyms. <laughs> just, do you I, see just said? I see a gym and I'm like, hey, gym, fucking get over here and fight me. <laughs> you see what that guy just said? He's no, like, what he said. Did you see the slowpoke? Damn, they they strong. <laughs> oh god, is he gonna send out a slowpoke? No, none of these people have slowpoke. Okay, I said like, that'd be yeah, weird. Paris, Paris. Fun fact, to my knowledge, at least in this generation, has the most weaknesses out of any Pokemon. Oh really? Well, tied tied with um. What is he? Bug? Egg, poison? Bug and grass. Is he you know, bug and grass? You know how bad that is. That's really bad. Um. Man, if, if he gets like, if like, he goes outside on a hot day, he just bursts <laughs> into flames. He does have dry skin as an ability. <laughs> Jesus. In the next generation, actually no, I think that's like in fourth generation, right. but still, he's tied with um, like his evolution, uh, Executor and, and Celebi. They have the most weaknesses. Wow. And in the new generations, there might be some, like, thing I'm not thinking of. Fucking fairies don't that don't exist. Fairies are great, dude. So, I mean, I don't know. Shout out, shout out to, our, to the fairies out there. Oh, yeah, for, for sure, man, for sure. <laughs> Let me demonstrate what I've learned from also, my studies. Also, I want you to take a quick guess right now. Is Bugsy boy or girl? He's a boy. Okay, good, you know. Yeah. Because based on that art... <laughs> no, yeah, there, there's this one uh, a remix uh, of the Blackthorn slash Azalea Town theme, mm -hmm. <laughs> and it has like a cute like anime picture of uh, Bugsy, a Bugsy, and then like who's what's the Blackthorn city gym? Uh, Claire, Claire, and like obviously Claire, was, you know, is looking fine or whatever, but then Bugsy looks fine. kind of like a girl, and people in the comments were like, "Yo, who's this cute chick?" And everyone's <laughs> like, "Nah, it's it's this guy. It's That's a boy." Meet Bugsy. <laughs> Meet Bubsy. <laughs> What could possibly go wrong? Oh my gosh. He, he sends out a he metapod that only has Harden. What could possibly go <laughs> yeah. wrong? It's just like one of those like, like movie, like cinema things. Like meet Bugsy. He runs the bug gym. You know, one day things got crazy <laughs> when his metapod evolved into Rayquaza. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Jo join them as this, this big summer. This dragon comes out of this little cocoon. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> holding up, oh cool. <laughs> he's just constantly screaming. <laughs> he turns his life upside down. <laughs> he's, he's like going down the street with like a like a little baby stroller with a giant Rayquaza coming out of it. Like yeah. ah! <laughs> <laughs> Seth Rogen as Rayquaza. <laughs> oh, dude, I'm a dragon. <laughs> oh shit! I my own blunts now. <laughs> James Franco, D Franco. <laughs> As Bugsy. Oh, it's Scyther. Oh, cool. oh, look out for this, by the way. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sleep him. I was gonna use this fairy cutter. I mean, we're pretty good, but... <laughs> Say, yeah? I'm just saying, this thing could be a... Should I keep around. going or not use this? Uh, it's up to you. Really that was just a miss, matter. right? That's it. It's just a miss. Yeah, no, a miss. Okay. You can keep going. Like, fairy cutter's not gonna... I'm gonna say it's not long. gonna kill me for a hot second, so... But there we go. The one nice thing about fairy cutter, though, is they did double its power in the later generations, which is really cool. Well, not double, I is think that they the one it. where you just use it again and again and get stronger? It just doubles in power until I think it hits like base 160 or something. Oh, okay. Oh, God. But yeah, it start, but in the newer generations, it starts at 40 instead of what 10. The <laughs> some, some, <laughs> some bullshit! <laughs> Sleep for one turn. Scyther, go to bed. Oh, boy. Come on, man. But yeah, I've been honest. I'm just gonna pack you. it. Yeah, what's that? Would you watch Bugsy the movie? Bugsy or Bubsy <laughs> the movie? No, no, Bugsy. Bugsy the movie that Bugsy we just movie. described? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I wouldn't watch it like because it was good. I just watched it because it'd be funny. Yeah, with Seth Rogen as Rick Weiser. Look, he's at one health. 
Happens. Come on. I don't think they use potions yet, so you're good. If you just want to attack the letter or whatever. I mean, I think he's going to outspeed me, but if he kills me, I'm going to just get a lot of, like, XP. Yeah. Oh, he's quick attack. You're fine. Uh, so that's, that's not going to kill me. Nope. What? That is going to kill me. Really? That's, wow. That's surprising. Um, okay. yeah, I guess we give it to Gaia. Yep. Give it to the egg. <laughs> give it to the egg. Come Go on. egg. He, like, hatches. He's, like, level 100. He's like, oh, me, he came out, came out strong. <laughs> Meat egg. <laughs> Meat egg. One day, he was just an egg, but then he grew legs. Just an egg with giant muscular legs. <laughs> Walking around. Like Machamp legs or whatever. <laughs> yeah. Walk, he walks away from all the other legs. He was born different. I just, I'm going to give you a little lick. It's our only attacking move. It's kind of sad. But... Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> there's nothing else to add well, to that. It's kind of sad. He, we can give him Ice Punch and Thunder Punch. A, he has no arms. I know. <laughs> Why is there so many Pokemon? Oh, wait. What's this? Curse? Oh. Um, no. I really don't like curse. Yeah. I don't like moves that drain your health in like the end game, to be honest. That yeah, that's a big thing. Cause it's just like a waste of potions and stuff. It's a waste of time. I don't like Cause the point of in-game is just like one hit KO things, you know? Right. And if you're trying to catch something, you're not gonna use curse or something. <laughs> yeah. I feel like stuff like that where it like drains your HP or stuff that's like basic sort of on a gamble I try to avoid. Oh, she still has one poke. I'm just gonna heal, uh, C Cabroni. It's oh, wait, no. I can't. He's dead. It's Kakuna. Oh, it's Kakuna. Never mind. Yeah, who cares? Why are you doing. <laughs> I don't know. He only has poison thing as an attacking move. You quad resist that and you're immune to poison. Oh, oh god. What are you doing? <laughs> okay, never mind. I can just lick him to death. <laughs> yeah. But no, that's like, that's like a big thing, you know. Like, if I were given a move. Where it's like it does 120, but it's 75, and then like another move where it's like 60, but it's 100. Mm -hmm. I take the 60. Really? Because I know that it's gonna hit. And but it's like the thing. You just, what's See, the thing? This, this is the thing. This is like a total. This is like a tr totally a thing in like the actual like competitive game. Because there's there's hidden power fighting, which is base 60 power, or you can use focus blast, which is 120 power but 70% accurate. People use focus blast over the hidden power just because like. The, like, how do I explain it? Like, you would rather take the chance of hitting Focus Blast Yeah Than, like, using the hidden power Yeah, although I would say it is a little different for Pokemon Like, for the Pokemon, uh, games, because Like, in-game? No, just, like, in competitive or whatever Because, oh, okay. like, um There are things that, like, change your, um Your accuracy, you know, like, smoke screen or whatever Like, the fact that those exist is a little different Because, like, you know, coming at it from, like I guess I can't really apply Smash, but I could apply like Yu-Gi-Oh! Okay. competitive play. Um, you know, if there's something where it's like, oh, I might get to do something really good, but it might like fucking, you know, fizzle and not do anything. Or there's something where it's like, oh, I definitely will get to do this. Not as good, but it's a guarantee. I would take the guarantee. Oh, yeah, consistency. Yeah, because like, you, you, you don't want to plan around too much. Like, there's already so much... Uh, so much randomness. It's like you want to try to minimize it as much as possible, especially in like the Pokemon true. TCG as well. Oh yeah, flip like coin, yeah, flip or, coin, coin flips, <laughs> or don't, or yeah, or never do that ever. Those are my favorite things as a kid. Though, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, they're very funny for Yo, sure. <laughs> just as a kid, just like what was it? Um, uh, the the Nino Reno card where you can use double kick. It's like flip two coins, thirty for each heads. You know, that was like oh my, yeah, yeah, that was like my favorite card. For sure, yeah. Like I wouldn't even use Nino King. It was Nino. It was Nino Reno, dude. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Car cards like that, and like in you know, or like a, a build like that, can be used though, if it's something where you can circumvent the bad thing, so that they're both actually kind of good. Like you know, like the the heads result is like something that does good, but the the you know, normally the the tails option or whatever would be like, oh, you lose like, you know, a certain amount of health, but then you have some other thing in play where it's like actually your opponent loses the health when you do that's like you know, shit like that is good. Oh, sweet. Yeah, that stuff, like, circumventing, uh, costs and, like, fucking stuff up like it is good, but, like, mm -hmm. generally, I would say, in, like, a turn-based competitive game, you'd want to stick with consistency. Of course. That's how you win. To a degree, though, that's what I always say, like, there's no solid rules, and really, like, no, pretty you much anything. Balance. Yeah, because, like, if something's, like, that good, but it's up to chance, like, you know, you're gonna do it. Yeah. So, what do we do now? Go into Ilex Forest? I think, uh, next episode... Next episode, I can go to Ilex. We should, we should go I, to, I can to, licks. The, to the Lix forest. I can lick the forest. And we'll, and we'll, uh, we'll look at Selby Shrine, but we'll not look at Selby itself. Yeah, it's true. Can you get Kurt to make me some balls?